Thanks a lot for that. Well, Sachidanand Uttikar of Trade Bulls is with us on the show. Sachidanand, your views on how to approach the market now and what are the stocks that you're looking at? Uh, good afternoon, Sonia. Good afternoon, Mangalam. Good afternoon, Ekta. I think uh, the Nifty is trending well. In fact, uh, it has been facing a lot of challenges around that 19,840, 850 kind of a mark. But if you look at uh, the way its uh, uh, daily RSI has uh, turned up, you know, it has been uh, consistently trending above that 50-52 uh, zone. Uh, currently, it is placed at around 56. Uh, even if you look at the short-term averages, uh, Nifty is trending above its five-day exponential moving average, which is placed at around 19,760. So I think the floor, uh, which was set a couple of uh, weeks back at around 19,540, looks very dependable. And from here on, you know, we don't see uh, uh, this particular level of 19,800 as a major hurdle. In fact, we are of the opinion that uh, once this particular level is crossed, uh, Nifty does not have any major resistance before the uh, uh, gap resistance uh, that was uh, being displayed on 20th of September at around 20,100. So I think the trajectory is clearly on the bullish side. Uh, we continue holding our bullish uh, outlook on the market. From a trading perspective, uh, one can place uh, fresh stop losses below 19,720 and start building up uh, long positions on the aggressive side. We are expecting a, a move towards 20,100 eventually. So the Nifty remains on the positive side. When it comes to bank nifty, uh, we do have challenges at uh, 44,700, 44,550 kind of a zone. But if you look at the uh, 60 minutes data, we clearly have a inverse head and shoulder formation, uh, which is about to get triggered on the bullish side. If you look at uh, the way its uh, uh, RSI is placed, it is almost at around 49. So it's an early sign that there could be a breakout soon in this particular index as well. And that's why we believe that uh, there could be a good, uh, strong rally uh, towards 45,300 eventually on a positional basis. So even here, uh, we're expecting that the 44,000 floor is well set and fresh stop losses can be considered at 44,350 when it comes to Nifty Bank and uh, long positions can be deployed even here. Uh, on the stocks front, uh, we are writing uh, two setups. Uh, one of them we have recommended to our clients, which is Bazaar Auto. On the weekly scale, uh, there's a bullish flag formation uh, the breakout is already set. We are expecting this particular momentum to uh, get carried forward towards 5280, and it, we may see a fresh life high on this particular counter. We are recommended uh, building long positions here. The stop loss should be placed at around 5092 for Bajaj Auto. And IRCTC, after a good consolidation, has displayed a breakout here. Uh, we are expecting uh, this particular momentum to continue towards 740 eventually. And even here, we are recommending building long positions with a stop loss at 706. Okay, all right, Sachitan. And we're going to leave it on that note. Thanks very much for joining in and speaking with us. Just